hello uh, so uh, here you can see there is error both column has given the error not applicable means something wrong in it so i am going to correct the formula first now the first formula is giving the error since first is giving there so i move to the second formula as well i have already created it now just copy this formula and paste it and copy it i told you that if first formula did not found put the second formula control r control d now you got a result so you hope you understood about it like suppose if you uh, want to able to there are two three and five sheets you have so you can easily get the data we have from the reference number in a multiple sheets that's what i'm saying because this formula is really help you now i'll give you another way how to use will because sometime you going for interview the people are um, give the dynamic data and you won't be able to find the result so i'm not going to biggest data but little bit data uh, little data uh, so let me create the data first so hope so either here i have already available so now i'm picking this one pick this one suppose uh, you have a data here not more just little bit so and just copy and paste as a value because it should be move any time it shows in copy so paste as a value now i'm pasting as a value and format so now i got the values and suppose this value have created in a text as a text values how would you do it just all de the window appear at your screen delimit now move to the next select tab and type of data do you want to extract just select text and finished value as you given the error here you can see just check is it a text or a value so now check is text is it text it says true it says true now i'm looking for data here here so i have to create one dynamic formula so let's let's take the value l d i'm giving multiple criteria so now another one is this and third here we'll get a result now if l d because you can use will be different different way you can think about how to use it i'm not saying uh, that uh, won't be possible to, to possible how to use it it's totally your views so this list i want so i'm creating data validation here now you can see i'm getting many of this all it all uh, things here now looking for header whatever header we have if i select header list if i select all headers here you have headers headers i have selected successfully now see the example you can so means if i select this this so hope so i will get a result so now create a vlookup formula vlookup lookup value is this it will not going to change it so if you want to fix go ahead no problem
but I do not want to fix it. This table array. So table which I am looking for this. This comma. I'm now require. I require the column index number. Column index number. So I'm using match here. Match this. Just lock the value. I don't. It, I don't want to move it. Also, it should not move. And select this. Now lock it. I block successfully. Now, when I got a match, I logged it. Sorry, I I think I went wrong. Match means means it this where we will match in c2 c2 just lock it then comma looking for exact value close the bracket this is true i'm getting na value why because i did not select the lookup value here now get the result it's mean we are right but here if i select income place of income i select uh, status the result will be different it means you can create a dynamic view lookup it will really help you so sometime if you go for interview and anywhere so might you get um, people will ask question and this way they will create a different seat they will give a criteria so might be want able to do it so that's i'm giving example i have another example as well so unfortunately uh, this is uh, this is good example for you i'll give another example now if i pick this one only and come here now I'm turning this value as a, as a values. So let me check: is this a tax? Is taxed? Is say false? Why? Because I have convert in. And suppose you have twenty thousand and uh, ten thousand data, then might will create every day. Sometime. Uh, people give a condition that do not change the data type so you won't change it how would you how would you get the result that's because question here so let me check the formula what is wrong in it nothing is wrong just for if you get a new question so if you try to find out the new uh, formula so really it will uh, you will get a new knowledge and new experience so now i'm going to put a vlookup I'm looking for this. This now comma table array is this. Lock it. Now come to the column array. So I'm looking for here. Don't have much column, so I'm looking to and comma zero. This, but I won't get a result. Why it happened? So maybe it will be give the bad result. So now I'm going to use match. Might be I'm wrong. This comma this comma zero comma this. Still I won't get a result. So something wrong in it. I don't know how would you do it. So let's find out what is the error. Error. Here we have a text. Sorry, here we have a value, and there is a tax value. It does not match together. That is, and I'm getting this problem. So now, I'll give you another example. Uh, I'll 
قبل شو 